Hernandez. Hernandez. Teo. 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 Hernandez. Teo. Hernandez. What a fucking goal. What a fucking goal. He's a left back. I'm a left back. My goodness, Ciao, 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 stamattina mi sono alzato e ho trovato l'invaso. O partigiano. Ciao Milanisti and benvenuto Rossoneri. This is your boy Ari and you're watching Rossonari TV. Milan 3, Spezia 0. Grande ragazzi, grande ragazzi. Up to about 65 minutes, we were a little slow, not really showing our vigor, but we kept our heads high, showed patience, and showed them who's boss in the last 30 minutes. AC Milan is unbeaten in 19 games. Diciannove, diciannove. Great game. Let me just say, I love you, Donnarumma. Also, Kier has formed a very solid partnership with Gabbia. What looked like a slightly nervous partnership about a few weeks ago has now turned into a solid enough partnership that we can at least rely on these two people if Romagnoli is absent. Gabbia has proven to be a decent partner in these small but important first five games. One more news on defense, Teo Hernandez has started scoring again. Bellissimo Teo, best left back in Syria if not Europe. And my cousin Calabria has been slowly proving since the start of this season that he might just secure that right fullback spot permanently. Talk about the midfield. Brahim Diaz is an absolute baller. He attacks, he orchestrates the midfield, and he comes back in defense. What more do you want from a Milanisti with some grinta? Alexis Salad Manager has started to look really in good. With each single game progressing, his confidence is really starting to build up and you can kind of see that when he's on the ball. Replace and now become a better Borini, the definition of hard work, grinta and character. Gattuso would have been proud. Gents, gents, Peter Hoge, I like what you're doing. You gave me two little stunts this week and I'm, I'm liking what I'm looking at. I cannot wait to see him build chemistry with Tonali and Benasser and Chalanolu and Kessi. And oh my god, our midfield. We'll be talking about midfield and not talk about one of the most informed midfielders across Europe now. My Turkish delight, Hakan Chalanolu. Mwah! Bellissimo Hakan. Assists, goals, positioning, the set pieces, the work rate, and the defensive duties that Hakan Chalanolu does. I don't have any words for it. He is simply a Turkish delight. Oh, you know, no disrespect to Tonali and the other young guys, but without Kessi and Benasser, our midfield doesn't really have a backbone. I'm excited to see how fast Pioli is able to achieve the chemistry between these two and the new guys like Tonali and Krunic and Hoga. Credit to my man Pioli for not just rotating well in this game, but all of last month. It was crucial for us. Grande ragazzi, five out of five wins, a very well-deserved rest now, and then we play Inter Merda. <laughs> oh, good ball in. Good ball! Diao! Rafael! Grande ragazzi! Grande ragazzi! Rafael Liao! That's what I want you for! The 18 year old! Rafael Liao, you as a striker are a different story, my man. Kind of lazy off the ball, unlike the other Milan players, so he annoys me a little when he's in attack. But hey, scored two clutch goals today. Like him on the left wing, but he put in a good shift as a center forward today. Something that's absolutely needed in the absence of Rebic and Papa Ibrahimovic. Anisti, we all know that we need a central defender. And the transfer market closes 12 hours from this video's upload. We have Diego Dalot, I believe, from Manchester United coming in on a dry loan. 
we have Schalke's Ozan Kabak, who Maldini apparently offered 12.5 million for, plus 3 million in bonuses. He spat on a guy recently though, for which he got a ban in the Bundesliga. And, you know, I don't like guys who do that kind of shit. But let's, but let's see. I have full confidence in Maldini, so I'm gonna leave it up to him for what he does on deadline day. This is the first time as a Milan fan that I'm seeing three wins in a row in the start of the season. I love it. I love the ragazzi. I love you all. We are going to be a force to be reckoned with when we have our full squad back against Inter Merda. Please like, comment and subscribe. This is your boy Ari. You're watching Rossonari TV. Ciao Milanista.